What's Ooh. good? What's everybody's real KJ? When I heard that they were making a Percy Jackson TV show, I was all excited for it. I even decided, you know what? I'm going to read the books. Read the books, and that way I can come and react to the show with book knowledge. I wanted to be one of them girls. I wanted to be a, yeah, the books were better girly. Um, uh, they changed this. This wasn't how it was in the books. I wanted to be one of them girls. So I went and bought the entire box set. And, and, I absolutely did it read the books um and so we are not going into percy jackson being a i read the books girly we are going into it being a i haven't read the book girly <laughs> and that's okay because this is where we thrive we thrive in never reading the books but only watching the movie slash show adaptations that's so that being said i did watch the movies growing up i watched the lightning thief i may have seen the sea of monsters with logan lerman i thought it was great i'm sorry like it's like a little guilty pleasure Apparently they're terrible if you read the books, but like I said, never done that. Anywho, we're gonna check out the show. I read the first five pages. No, I read the first chapter, so I know I, I have, I read the first chapter knowledge. Being a half-blood is dangerous. If you think you might be one of us. Oh, I remember this line. I, while you still can. I remember this line from the first chapter. Yay, first chapter knowledge. Don't say I didn't warn you. Okay, Percy. Oh, this looks, this feels, feels like a movie. My name is Percy Jackson. I'm 12 years old. Okay, 12. That's me. Why was I up there? I saw something. These impossible things. So they just be walking around? I guess they're like invisible to the eye, human eye. <clears throat> or is he just imagining things? I don't know. Hey, fellas, wanna come here about the imaginary- Ugh! Hey, fellas. <laughs> You like popsicles? Hey, Phyllis. I met Grover. Oh, that's Grover? Okay. Like, I'm, like, naturally comparing it to the movie. In the movie, they're, like, teenagers. Or, yeah, like, in high school. You can almost believe they were imaginary. Until the day one of them decided to come for me. This feels like a movie. Because he was a hero? Not everyone who looks like a hero is a hero. And not everyone who looks like a monster is a monster. Is it? Oh, I'm right here, sweetie. Mommy's here. Girl, do not play with me. You will learn to control yourself. Do you understand me? Me? Do you understand me? All I said was mom. Hang on to that. There's a mighty instrument. He's like a pin. No, there's one thing I know about bullies it is that you should never, ever stand up to them. That doesn't sound right. <laughs> oh. I'm about to beat this bitch up. Percy? Here, Percy, do what you gotta do. You're done. I didn't even touch her. We're not fools, Percy Jackson. Oh, Mrs. Dodds, um, what are you doing in my mind? Okay, Mrs. Dodds. Okay. That was fast as heck. I feel like I remember that scene being longer. Like when I read the book, when I read the first chapter, I was like, I think that scene was a little too fast. What happened? Where's Mrs. Dodds? And then like everyone's everyone's memories like erased or something. Didn't anyone just see that? Where's Mrs. Dodds? Who's Mrs. Dodds? There's no one here by that name. The gaslighting is real, right? right guys, or was she really not there? I don't know. Was she really not there? I thought she. Maybe she was just there, but no one else seen her. Yet you have offered no explanation for how she ended up in that fountain, other than, uh, I didn't touch Nancy. I didn't touch her, like, what do you want me to say? Isn't there anything else you'd like to say for yourself? Do you want me to lie on the stand? Like, you obviously want me to lie. Do you have anything to add? Grover. Percy had told me earlier in the day that he wanted to uh, get back at Grover. Nancy for all she'd done to us. I know you lie. We supposed to be best friends. Are you saying you saw Mr. Jackson assault Miss Bobo Finn? The betrayal is real. Yes. Oh, wow. Even at 12 years old, you can't trust nobody. I didn't touch Nancy. I know you didn't. I didn't say hear you speaking up for me. I know you think you didn't. Oh, well, he actually did do something, but like... Hello, Percy. Hey, Eddie. Sorry about that. I'm walking out. You're walking in. Oh, does he have a, another um douchey stepdad? Is my mom home from work. Oh, is that all you gotta say to me? Huh? 
After failing out of school? Are you my dad? You're not my dad. I'm not gonna explain nothing to you. I found Gabe on the phone with the headmaster. I told him I believe my kid. It was a real short call. Period. You better. Since when are you going to Montauk? I called to reserve the place as soon as I got off the phone with Yancey. Who's Yancey? The school. <laughs> I was about to say the same thing. I really was about to say, who's Yancey? Take your shoes off before you get in my car. What? Bro, I'm not doing all that. This was the thing from the intro, right? Who are you? So scared. I mean, you're terrifying. Who are you? That's the question. Now we're at the museum and you saw something. Felt real to you, but no one else could see. Okay, so no one else could see that lady? Because in the book, the part I left off on, I thought that they was just, I thought they was gaslighting him. Like, they didn't want to reveal the secret just yet. So they were like, oh, there's no Mrs. Dot. How did you know about that thing I we saw? We come to this place every year because this is the place I met your father. Girl, how you just met Poseidon, right? How you, how you just met this man casually? Here on the beach, he was wise and brave and kind. Let me see what he looked like. I want to see what actor they get. He wasn't a man at all. He was a god. You fell in love with God? Like, <laughs> like Jesus? Not God, a god. That's interesting. Have Mom, children together, stop. children Mom. called demigods, and sometimes they are known. This is reminding me of... You were a half-blood. Grover. Grover? Grover. What is he doing here? I don't want to see him. <laughs> He's hurt. Hear it. Grover? Percy? So Are his legs out? Grover, why is there half a goat in your pants? <laughs> it's the way he said it. So the important thing is not to panic. Oh, he's so cute. I'm your best friend. And what are you? Uh, what do you call half a goat? Oh, satyr. And I'm your protector. If I hadn't gotten you kicked out of school, you'd have never survived the night. Oh, that's what you were doing? Well, none of us saw Dodds coming. Oh, so you didn't see it? You for real so didn't see her? The mist kept her hidden even from us until it was too late. Oh, so you did see it. So Das was just pretending? She just popped up and started to pretend to be a teacher. Bro, I cannot see it. It's so dark. Boys? Yeah, I'm actually 24. Hold on. What? He's 24? I was going to say, how old is this kid? I, I was really going to say, like, how old is he? This man said, I'm actually 24. Okay, mom. Period. Is the mom gonna get captured like um the movie? What do you mean go? I can't go with you. Why can't you? Only half less. She's human. You're gonna need to be brave now. Now, Poseidon knew he wasn't supposed to be getting down with no humans. <laughs> Dang, he big. I couldn't get a clear look at him before. <laughs> this mom is so brave. I love her. She will protect her kid. Yep. W mother. Oh. W mother. He's gonna watch her get eaten? Oh, shoot. You're supposed to run away. Now he can see you or smell you. This kid handles terrible news or like shocking news like a champ. He was surprised at Grover's legs, but that's about it. His mom disappears. No scream, no cry. Oh, he's good. He, he said, I'm standing on business. He gonna stand on business. Ain't no time for crying. Yeah. <laughs> Bro. We can leave the tears for tomorrow. Period. Okay, purse. He's brave. That's good. He ain't scary. So I don't want to see nobody trying to punk him at this little school he going to or whatever you call it. That's a big thing you going up against. What? His own horn killed him? He must be the one. Hush, Annabeth. Mr. Bruner, are you here also? Dang, Bruner. Welcome to camp. We got a lot of action back there. <laughs> Big dog, like. It's real long back there. Interesting. Okay, I like it. I like it. I accidentally vaporized my pre-eligible teacher. That was the um, title of the first chapter. I remember it because I read the first chapter and I said, but um, I remember them being at the school a little bit longer, but I guess they can't put every single detail inside the, the show or whatever, but it don't matter. The stories that I have told you about Greek gods and heroes and monsters, they are real. In the land of gods and monsters. Oh, jump scare, like girl. Where am I? 
You cannot be popping up on somebody you like sure. that in this you dark sleep. room with lightning when I was just passed out. Like, I'm thinking you a sleep paralysis demon or something. Like, uh-uh. What are you doing? Annabeth. Girl, I'm already seeing visions. Like, no. You still here? Oh, let's go over. It's a big deal to kill a monster like that. So I wanted everyone to know. Did you see it? Period. Ride or die. Ride or die, Grover. I gotta remember that he's 24, not 12. I'm pretty sure he's, like, young in real life, though. Not 24. Maybe if I told you the truth a little sooner, your mom would still Please. be here. Please. Stop. I know this isn't easy, but I want to talk about it. I don't. Bro, you can't just talk about it. It's his mom that died, not yours. Your job was to get me here alive. Your job is done. <laughs> this man, he moves and acts and talks like he's been alive for years and he's just tired. I'm just exhausted. Mr. D, this is uh, Percy Jackson. That's Dionysus. Who? The god Dionysus? Yes. Well, he's not much to look at. I think my dad may be around here somewhere. I don't know how to ask him. I don't, I don't even know his name. Son. Dad? He's yes, playing. <laughs> Before we get to know each <laughs> Stupid, bro. Not Mr. Brunner. You look so unserious with this blazer on, bro. Mr. D is not your father. Demigods are able to do things for gods that gods are forbidden to do for themselves. Mr. D was taking advantage of it. Sounds very backwards. Unless you surrender it, it will always find its way back to you. Well, that's nice. Twelve cabins for twelve Olympian gods. Each cabin is home to the children. That god has claimed. Oh, you just claim kids? You haven't been claimed, Percy. What? Well, when do I get claimed? I don't get it. I thought that these gods, said they come down, they procreate with humans, and boo, demigods, like half bloods, but like. This is Percy Jackson. I trust you will see to whatever he needs. Wait, it's Grover. No, Grover is um a satire or whatever. So he's not like an unclaimed kid. What? He has a little pallet, a little sleeping bag. He don't get a bed. I remember what happened to you on the hill, and I just... I have to say I'm really sorry. I don't feel like this is genuine. I'm Luke. 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 Do I remember the name Luke? Percy. I don't remember the name. I don't. Where are you going? Oh, shoot. What in the camouflage? Is that your mom? Over. What are you getting yourself into? So I, I went to the Cloven Council and they had actually heard of this happening before. And that when a mortal is really close to death, Hades himself can actually reach out and- Yes. But doesn't he deserve to know the truth? Groven, the truth can be very dangerous. I don't want to lie to him anymore. You have to stop telling him stuff and go tell him personally. <sighs> I know how you feel. I feel like I heard his, his voice. Is that supposed to be Hades or I don't know, but his voice sound familiar. You okay? We all have them, you know. Intense, recurring nightmares. Luke, how you got that scar? How'd you get that scar? Hermes is my father. So they just claim random kids. Demigods have always fought for glory. People listen closer when you talk. And they think twice about messing with you. Ooh. Hey! Wait, so this is the kid who killed the Minotaur. I, I, I think I might like Clarice. Yeah. Why are you always getting punked by girls? <laughs> 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 All right, Clarice, you ain't gotta be like that. Aries kids. Why don't they mess with Who's you? Who's Aries? They know better. Luce is strong. Period. They know better. Y'all know better. So if I get glory, Clarice won't mess with me either. Glory to glory to glory to glory to glory to glory. I've never done anything like this before, and it looks. You took down a minotaur. You never killed a minotaur before either. That's how you did. That was different. I was I was avenging my mother. So is Luke our friend? I'm trying to think of what that guy name was from that movie who had actually stole the lightning thing or whatever, and he had he had um set up Percy. Was his name Luke? I think. I've made some friends here. I hope so. Real friends. <laughs> oh, Grover wasn't a real friend? They like me. Grover was a real friend. Man, I really hope that Luke isn't that bad guy. Ignoring me is one thing, but he doesn't get to ignore you. Period. He gonna defend his mother. I'm gonna make him come down here. Ooh, what you gonna do? Oh, shoot. Girl, hey Clarissa. Can't sleep, huh? Uh-uh. 
Oh my gosh, really? Every new kid shows up here and they think they're special. You, you just think met you're special? Girly. I took down a minotaur to save my mother. Go find you a minotaur to take down. Tell me you made it all up about the minotaur and I'll let you go. I didn't make anything up. Marissa, I really thought I could like you. Never mind. Ugh, y'all disgusting. Period. No, I'm about to regurgitate it, make y'all all swallow. Period, period. How does that taste? Yeah, Clarissa. You know better now. First the Minotaur, now the toilet. Try it again. You were there the night in the infirmary. Are you stalking me, Annabeth? Yes. Uh, well, at least she's honest. So I know if you can help me. What you trying to do? You do what? Win capture the flag. Be no maiming and no killing. Any magical items you may possess are permitted as well. Let the games begin! I'll see you on the other side. Y'all are taking this really serious. But I need this to go well today. You still don't get where you fit into all this, do you? She's gonna cut us down. Annabeth's got a plan. Percy's on it. Percy's on it? He's gonna be ready. Oh my gosh, really? He kind of looks like that white kid also. Well, he's not ready. Not even on guard. Is that Clarissa? Clarissa. Sweets, you don't want it. That other person better not join in. Really? Y'all all weak, bro. Like, Clarissa, if you really want to fight, you could have fought me on your own. Like, you got it. Man, let's get to some water. Because they playing games right now. Hero. You was there the whole time? Were you here the whole time? <laughs> I'm sorry. She looked like Caleb McLaughlin. Is that what is his sister? You? Oh, yeah. You healed. Oh, shoot. Your dad's calling. Oh, now you want to talk. Now you want to talk. You have been claimed by Poseidon. Percy Jackson. Son of Poseidon. As a forbidden child of the sea god, you are singular amongst demigods. Oh, he got a kid? Zeus is looking for a thief. Sees a forbidden child claimed by his jealous brother. That if he doesn't return the bolt in one week, there will be war. Y'all got too much going on. I know it sounds daunting. They need to go handle their own business. You are his son. I am Sally Jackson's son. The fate of the world hangs in the balance. Go handle it. Are you not a god? Rover. Sally Jackson is alive. If you can find her there, I think you can bring her back. There we go. We have our mission. When do we leave? That kid gonna do anything for his mom. That's what's up. This is weird. This is my first time hearing it happen like this. I thought, was that how it was in the movies, though? Like, I thought that Poseidon, because she said she met a man <laughs> on the beach. And so I just automatically assumed some stuff went down and boom, Percy. But I guess not. They got to clean kids. Who the heck? Hi, I'm Percy. It's nice to meet you. Is this another dream? I was told a quest isn't a quest until oh. you said so, considering your Halloween decoration. Nah, she's real. Uh-uh. There couldn't have been someone else we had to talk to? Mm -mm. Yeah. Keep that in. Ah! Really? <laughs> Who's this? Shall go west and face the god who has turned. Oh, that was that was the dad. I mean the um the mom's husband or whatever? Her step whatever. The entrance to Hades domain lies under the city of Los Angeles. Is where you will journey to. Time is short. City of Los Angeles. Candidate. LA. The first quest mate shall be Annabeth Chase. So, who'd you choose to go with you? You? No, seriously, who'd you choose? Bro, we've been in this since the beginning. You shall be betrayed. What? The one who calls you friend. Oh, never mind. I know this. He I thinks you. He thinks it's gonna be him. If it's anything like the movie, then it has to be the guy who stole the lightning bolt, which I think is Luke. I just can't remember if his name was Luke or not. But he's the only person we met and the only person we consider like a friend or whatever. Yeah, him. How much money did they give you? It has to be him. I brought you this. 
What's in there, Luke? A gift from my dad. Just take care of each other out there. When Annabeth first arrived here with Thali and Luke, they were being chased by monsters. Mrs. Dots? Yes. One was our algebra teacher, Electo. Thalia turned back to fight to buy her friends some time. Her satyr protector tried to stop her, but she wouldn't listen. The most powerful being in the universe's best idea to save his daughter's life was to turn her into a tree. She fought valiantly, and she met a hero's fate. She met a pinecone's fate. <laughs> she met a pinecone's fate. Do exactly as I say, and maybe you survive this. Um, this Are is my here? quest. This is my quest, ma'am. But if this is so important, why didn't Chiron spring for plane tickets? This seems kind of low priority, doesn't it? Sorry. <laughs> he said, where's the glitz and the glam? Where's the luxury? You're a forbidden child. Zeus might decide to take a shot at you himself. <sighs> the sky is his domain. Oh, like he can't, he can't get me right here? Dang, let's, let's, let's hit up the sky. I'm trying to see what's gonna happen. Chips and sodas okay for you guys? I don't think you should just get to decide we don't vote. Oh golly, the road's getting bumpy because- Can she go get the snacks already before the bus takes off? Chips and sodas okay for you guys? Whatever. Yes, please. A Mrs. Dodds! It's a Mrs. Dodds! The trick is to spot them first before they spot you. <laughs> it's important to remember that if you've ever got to confront one. I've seen her before. We've seen this one. We've seen her before, right? I think if she you knows. Guys were better at your job, I might not have noticed you here so easily. I'm here to collect your friend. Collect them? Yes, guys, you need to open that window. You oh, they look normal to her. Okay. Wait, are those the twins they were talking about? Electo? He's on my side. What makes you think that? He's my protector. It's his job. He was my protector first. First? He's protected a lot Very of kids. Exciting. Thalia, Luke, and Annabeth had a Seder protector. It was you. Why didn't you tell me? Do you guys smell that? Hamburgers. Oh, oh Medusa. On. You should have accepted my offer when you had the chance. Offer? What offer is she talking about? Not today, friends. Not on my doorstep. Don't look! I have something to resolve. Why not come inside? Bro, and not y'all all cowering. I'm Medusa. You must be hungry. I left snacks on the table while I get something proper going. Can we trust this? It's reminding me of that um, Hansel and Gretel story percy i'm not gonna lie to you i'm really hungry and i'm ready to take that chance <laughs> you are loyal to your mother you stand by her Athena was everything to me she never answered but then one day another god came and he broke that silence the sea god told me that he loved me but then athena declared that i had embarrassed her and i needed to be punished she decided that I would never be seen again by anyone who would live to tell the tale. That is not what happened. And you are a liar. I could help you remove them from the equation so that you can be free of them. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Yeah, now you're gonna take your snakes out. We went inside her basement, bro. We couldn't have found a different place. She lures everyone in. Hey, come get some burgers. We are not our parents until we choose to be. A daughter of a self-righteous mother. She wants them to hate their parents so bad. Let's have a look at you. But girl, you ain't innocent because what's all this about? Now. What? Okay, that was pretty smart. My hands are kind of full. I kind of like the movie, the movie scene better with Medusa. <laughs> Period. Can we talk about the bigger issue here? You could have saved your mother. You should have accepted my offer. What's that about, do you think? And why do we have to hear it from Electo? Enough! She has a valid excuse. She literally got the news, she got the offer, and then automatically she came to you. You shall be betrayed by one who calls you a friend, and you shall fail to save what matters most in the end. I chose her because I couldn't imagine we'd ever be friends. And now I'm feeling so alone. At least you told them the truth. Now we can work it out. Electo offered to help our quest if I gave you up to her. What did you say? I killed her sister. What'd you say? I got off her head. Period. I think I've got a better idea what to do with this. You can't ship Medusa's head to Olympus. They will see this as impertinent. I am impertinent. Our it's just going to go to Olympus? Olympus is at the top of the Empire State Building with best wishes. Let's see if they accept. 
Why does he look evil? You guys are not gonna believe this. Hermes. You have to let go, Percy. I can't. Yeah, you really can. You just have to. Can we go home now? Percy, we paid for this class. Honestly, I quit swimming lessons as well when I was a kid. You know, I just breathe, mommy. That's what you always tell me to do. Not when your child's more stable than you. Oh, dream sequences, okay. It couldn't have just been a normal little flashback. Hello again, little hero. I'm tired of this the voice. A forbidden child attracts attention. Okay, I still forgot. I gotta go back to when they were explaining the forbidden children and whatnot. Because I forgot what that is. She is coming. Who is she? She. You and Dahlia were really close, right? When Luke and Dahlia found me, Luke cared for me right away but i find it hard to believe that luke is the the one who stole the lightning bolt you want to know how i ended up alone on the road in the first place we're born from a thought in her mind and then given to a partner she feels connected to my father cared for me then he met a woman that was a problem damn it's messed up so i left i was seven Seven years old, you just out on the streets? Dang, you was brave and bold also. Fail to save what matters most. That can mean a lot of things. That's how prophecies work. That's how fate works. Can I see your tickets, please? He's not real. He's a thingy. He's a thingy. You're in cabin 17B. No, you're a liar. Can I explain? Oh, never mind. So we're just killing time till we find out that guy's like a werewolf or something, right? That's what I'm saying. Like, until we, he's a monster for sure, right? Well, if he's not a monster, what's going on here? A monster is in here. It's that lady. Because what you rolling up on us for? Do you mind if I say it? I do mind, actually. You're the witness, right? What you lying for? You didn't hear no kids screaming. Scared when they're all alone. You want us to be scared, okay. don't you? I'm a mom. I know how scared you must be. Nar, nar. You're too creepy Excuse to be one. Me? You kidnap kids. I don't actually think that you made that mess back there. So what you lied to the police for? I just wanted a moment alone with you. You're a monster. Something on your jacket looks like... It's a monster. Can y'all put two and two together? Y'all know the mission you're on. Why y'all just talking to this woman casually? And the monster's in the bag also. It's time for us to skedaddle. It's time for us to skedaddle. I'm going to have to bear the burden of your parents' mistakes today. I don't know who you are, but I think I know what you are. So are we just sitting here? A few monsters like you, and we sent them all packing. Oh, because we big dogs. We ain't gotta run. They know better. Of course they're like me. They were my children. Who are you? Children. The woman that's coming. That that's the voice said. There are monsters. A kidna. Hmm. Okay, Echidna. She's just a pup now. Today, you will be her prey. <laughs> Not today. We actually have plans. You should run now. I Me, mean, I try to I try to tell y'all to run earlier. But ain't nobody wanna listen to me, so you got ahead of yourself. We work on that. We have these monsters roaming. Can they attack humans or no? Oh, it looks like a dog. There's an Athenian temple in somewhere in the middle of downtown St. Louis. Yes. No monsters can enter. Not even a kitten. We're safe. Great. Mm. Somewhere around here, the oracle is laughing at us, but you know. <gasps> oh, the poison is taking effect. I think the singer things were poisonous. And it hit him like here. That's like close to his heart. Or not. Oh, he looks. He looks sick. He looks deadly. Oh my gosh! The last thing we need is the monster. She's here. Keep going, girl. Keep going. What did she say? She's inside. I thought she couldn't get in. How did the chimera even get inside here? Athena would have had to let her in, but why would she do that? Annabeth, what did Echidna say to you? She said my impertinence wounded my mother's pride. And that that will be my doom. Medusa's head. I embarrassed my mother. Girl! It embarrassed her. So... She's punishing you? Girl, see, these Greek gods suck. I'm sorry. Like, give me Jesus 80 day. Like, you sent ahead. You embarrassed me. Now fight this battle on your own. Take this. 
That's messed up. Oh, Percy! That's so messed up. We're gonna leave that girl to fight this monster. This is a baby? Don't fight it. You'll just make her angry. Ooh. That her skin is too thick. You have to pierce in the heart or in the eye. Or probably somewhere right here. That's why she has those stings there. Because she has the soft spot. So hit her in the soft spot. Soft spot. Oh man, you lost it. Percy. Is there water around that fountain? Because I need Poseidon to show up. I need you to like, where you at? The water fountain. Period. You better show, you should better come through. Wait, the water came up, right? Or am I tripping? No, it would have been a hard hit and he would have, um, he would have died from that height. You are frightened. Wait, can he breathe in the water? Your father sent me to tell you. What did he say? All right. It is so hard for him to stand back, to see you struggle, but he's here. And he's so very proud. Trust him. Just breathe. Yeah, girl, you can breathe in the water. Yay, purse. Okay, that was episode five. This was episode four. Not five. I think this is the best episode so far. I really enjoyed it. Um, I see that Percy's dad decided to come on through, pop up. But I, I, I enjoyed the show. I'm trying to see. I feel like because the movie is a movie. I don't know. I really enjoyed the movie. Like, I'm sorry. I like the Percy Jackson movie. I know I feel like a lot of people don't like it. But I also never read the book. So, I guess if this is book accurate. I enjoyed the show too. I enjoyed the show also. But I really do like the movie as well. Like, I don't. I can't really say that this is better than the movie. In my personal opinion. But... That was the first four episodes. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, do not forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. It's your girl, KJ. Before we actually start our Patreon.